Hey guys, it's John. Um, posting this video because I feel like I owe people an explanation for where I've been and uh, I haven't posted a video in about four weeks. So I'll give you the short version and then I'll give you the long version. Uh, the short version is my aunt passed away suddenly earlier this month and it's just been really hard to work through because I had Thanksgiving, um, I've had four family deaths over the past four years and it's just been difficult. It all, the grief all snowballed this month, uh, with this latest one. And, um, I'm not going to talk publicly about what happened, but basically the circumstances around how she passed away made things challenging and complicated in ways that uh, the others haven't been, I guess. Um, so a lot of you know that um, my dad suddenly passed away in spring 2020. Um, that was tough because, you know, it's my dad and it happened during the pandemic and everything. But uh, I think I took about a month, month and a half off afterwards. Um, I've had two other family deaths. I don't make a video every time there's a death in the family, but, um, I've had two others in the past four years and, uh, pretty much I'm, I'm ready for it to be over. <laughs> ready for it to stop happening. There's not a whole lot of us left to die at this point. So, um, you know, hopefully we catch a break for a while, but, uh, yeah, it was just hard. Um, I sort of tried to come back last week. I did a couple streams earlier, early in the week, but I think it was because Thanksgiving was looming overhead and I just didn't, uh, yeah, I, I just kind of had that looming over me, I guess. And so they were kind of, not bad streams, but I just wasn't into it. So I guess they were kind of bad streams. Uh, and so I was like, you know what, I need to just, I just fade back, you know, until after Thanksgiving is over. So Thanksgiving is over now. And um, we're heading into another great month for missing family, December. Uh, but I'm, you know, I took a couple weeks off and I'm hoping to uh, get back into it starting in December. Is what I'm hoping. Um, I posted about all this on Twitter, but I don't, I don't really check. I haven't really been checking my YouTube comments much in the past few weeks. I haven't been on my computer much in the past few weeks, actually. I haven't played video games. I've been too busy helping out my family uh, with things because there's a lot of things to help out with. Um... So I haven't really been, not only have I not really been in the mood to make any videos, I haven't been, I haven't been playing games, I haven't been, uh, on the computer much, and in, in, in any capacity, so, uh, but I'm hoping to come back to it soon. You know, it really sucks because, um, I was actually really excited about this month, because at the beginning of the month, I was feeling pretty good about things at the beginning of November. And that's kind of unusual. Um, if you've been a longtime viewer of the channel, you may have noticed that um, I get kind of like, I don't know if it's seasonal affective disorder or what, but like after Halloween, when, when we start getting into November, I tend to get kind of depressed. Not clinical depression or anything, just kind of like my mood is just not high energy. I'm, I get very low energy in November and it tends to be a month where I don't post as many videos and maybe I post a vlog like this where I talk about you know like I'm just not feeling it and I was feeling good at the beginning of this November and I was excited because I was like this is gonna be a productive month um, I started working on the next wolf watch video I thought things were gonna be different this year and then um, that happened so, but what can you do, you know? That sort of thing, like, trumps anything else. 
when when something like that happens. So yeah, Thanksgiving was um smaller this year. Um Yeah, it kind of sucked too because um Kimmy and I hosted Thanksgiving and it was the first Thanksgiving that we had since the pandemic started because we didn't do one, we didn't go to one or host one or anything in 2020 or 2021. And so this one this year, I was excited for it to be our like we're we're officially back at family gatherings. This is it. Um, and then, you know, it was, um, it was just different, you know, cause my aunt always, she never missed a Thanksgiving. Whenever we invite her, um, she would, she would come, she would, she would always be there. She always made family gatherings a priority. So, um, but yeah, it was just, um, it was Kimmy's side of the family, and then for my side of the family, it was just uh, me, my mom, and my brother. And it's hard because five, four or five years ago, there would have been four other people there from my side of the family at least. So um, just kind of uh, feels bad, man. So... Yeah, I just haven't been in the mood. I kind of just needed to wait until Thanksgiving was over. And now that it's over, um, I'm hoping to get back in the swing of it because, you know, you need to give yourself time to grieve. It's important. You can't rush back. And I know that you need to take your time and you need to uh, process things properly. Um... Because if you, if, if I just, if it happened and then immediately I was like, I'm back to work. I'm doing, I'm constantly, I'm streaming. I'm putting out videos. Then I would be avoiding it. Um, and then it might come crashing down even harder later. So I really wanted to take time to process it and, and um, yeah, no, I don't need to, I don't need to explain every detail of it, but uh yeah, so I'm, I'm, but I think now, I think now that Thanksgiving is over, I think I'm in a good place now. Um, I'm still sad, but you know, you're always, that's one thing I learned when my dad passed is that, uh, you're always going to be sad about it. You're always going to be kind of upset, <laughs> like, uh, on an upset level of one through 10, where, you know, most of the time you would be at a zero, uh, grief kind of makes it kind of moves the baseline up from zero to one or two, um, depending on the day. Like that's the minimum amount of upset you are at all times from now on. So, but anyway, um, yeah, so I'm looking forward to, uh, getting back to videos and stuff. Probably the next video you'll see from me will be Callisto protocol. Um, so just look forward to that. I have uh, I have some other videos in the works. I'm doing another Wolf Watch video. So yeah, things are things are happening. Um, I did post about all this on Twitter, um, but I think I started talking about this earlier. Then I got sidetracked. Uh, I haven't been checking my YouTube comments much, but when I have, I've seen a lot of like, "Where is he? What's happening? What's going on?" Um, so if you're ever, like, this is why I always say, if you ever wonder what's going on with me, you can check my Twitter. It's not to promo my social media because I want to get a bunch of followers there or anything. It's it's so, I mean, it's a little bit of that. There's a little bit of that. But it's it's for people to keep updated on things when there's gaps, like, I'm just not around for three to four weeks. You know, because I don't always want to sit down with with face cam on and explain traumatic things. <laughs> Sometimes a little bit of text will just have to do it. And the YouTube community tab is not it. Um, that stuff gets suppressed like hell because of the algorithm. Um, so that's why I say Twitter. And you don't need to you, you don't even need to have a Twitter account or the app to look at Twitter. So that's why I always say that's why I choose that one. To be like, if you don't know what's happening, you can go there and find out. Um, you know, 
if it was if it was gate kept by you having an account or needing to have the app, then I wouldn't say go there. Eh. Anyway, so just just for future reference, if there's ever a time when like oh he hasn't posted in like a month, um, that's that's probably where you can find information, because uh, I'm not one to just disappear. Uh, I'll always have some kind of notification for it somewhere. Um, yeah, I guess that's, I don't know, is there anything else I want to say? Oh, uh, another thing you might have missed on Twitter is that I'm also in the process of making a video game. So, it's not a horror game. Because I know, I know, so, I know, I know somewhere people were gasping. <gasps> John's making a horror game. No, it's not a horror game. Um, in fact, you probably won't be interested in it. Um, uh, just, just saying. It's a niche idea for a niche genre. I don't really want to go into too much detail about it, but it's something I've been working on for like two years in the background. Um, it's been taking a lot of my time, especially lately, because it's been the only, it's been the only thing that I've really... I, I don't want to make videos or play games or anything. Um, so when I was on the computer, I was working on my game. But um, yeah, I made an announcement about that on Twitter, but I didn't, I've never talked about it in a video, so you may have missed that too. Uh, I'm trying to think of anything else that's been going on with me. It's nice to have a little chat like this. I guess that's about it. Um, well, I've been talking for about, what, 12 minutes, so probably about time to wrap it up. Um, but yeah, I'm not gonna, I hate making videos like this. It just feels like, feels like I'm getting too personal. I mean, it was one thing when my dad passed. Had to say something about that. But, um, at the same time, you know, when you don't post anything for like three and a half weeks, people start thinking, is he dead? Is he dead in a ditch somewhere? My dad always used to text that to me uh, whenever he would be like, where are you? And then I wouldn't respond. He would call me and leave me a voicemail and ask me if I was dead in a ditch somewhere. <laughs> he got a kick out of that. Um, I didn't so much get a kick out of it. I get, I'm getting a kick out of it now, which is nice. But, <clears throat> yeah, I guess it's about it. Um, I'll probably be streaming this week. And I'll probably come back uh, starting December 1st with videos. So I'll be working on that in the meantime. What day is December 1st? It's like in a couple days, right? Uh, Tuesday's the 29th. Wednesday's the 30th. So Thursday, yeah, Thursday, I guess, is when I'm planning on having videos resume. Um, got some exciting videos in the works, so, um, if it doesn't happen on December 1st, though, then, uh, the grief bug hit again, but hopefully it doesn't. All right, thanks for listening, and I'll see you in the next video. Sorry about the bummer of a video, but, uh, you know, life's not all rainbows and sunshine and butterflies, so, sometimes shit happens. All right. Um, oh, oh, oh. Probably I should probably mention doing the last charity stream of the year sometime this month, and I will be doing another cosplay. I haven't decided what it is yet, but, um, well, I haven't decided what the charity is yet. I have decided what the cosplay is. You will like it. Okay, it is. I will just give you the hint that it's a Resident Evil character, and I've already done an, I've already done an Ada cosplay earlier this year, so it's not her, but someone else. Um, a popular character that you will all enjoy. All right, so that's happening sometime in the next uh, three weeks, probably. So stay tuned for details on that. Again, I'm not gonna. I'm probably not gonna make an entire video all about it. So you can follow on social media if you care to keep abreast of those things. And that's another hint. <laughs> that's another hint for you. A little subtle, that one. Um, all right, well, I'll, uh, yeah, I'll talk to you later. Thanks for listening, and uh, see you in the next video. Bye-bye. Uh,